Hello from Phoenix Airport from the Car Rental Center. I'm going to take a look at some of the cars they have available here. And I just want to say thank you to everyone. We just passed 1,000 subscribers. Thanks everyone for uh, watching all the videos and tuning in. And we'll see what's coming up in the future for the channel. If you've got any ideas, comments, as always, please feel free to comment below any of the videos. Love the feedback. And pretty exciting. Thanks again for hitting. 1,000 subscribers, now let's take a look at some of the cars available here. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. We are at Phoenix Airport at National Car Rental. And we're gonna take a look at some of the cars they have available here. They have a lot of cars, so I'm gonna try and split things up a little bit. Uh, just a quick reminder, go ahead and click on that subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. If you wanna see more of these videos, give it a quick like. And we'll start things off here. We got a Genesis in uh, Premier Selection. And we've got a Lincoln SUV, we've got a Range Rover, and then, you know, this is probably one of the biggest executive aisles I've seen, so let's just do the executive aisle and I might split things up a little bit further. Uh, here we got a uh, V6 Chevy Camaro, and uh, they got a lot of new cars in. The uh, Camaros actually are a little bit newer, and we'll get to one in a bit that uh, only has 28 miles on it. Uh, what do we got here? A couple of Malibus, got a Ford Escape, got a Camry, got a Honda, got a GMC Terrain, Nissan Titan pickup. These are all executive aisle again. Uh, we got a VW, and we got another Malibu. And just kind of go around the other side here. We got a Chrysler 300, and we got a Dodge Charger. Uh, we got another Malibu, two Malibus here. And we've got a couple Nissans. Uh, these are probably Ultimas. And then here's this uh, brand new Chevy Camaro V6. These are the base model, but there's still lots of lots of fun to drive here. I'll just put the as in here. So this one's got 28 miles on it. And as soon as I opened up the door, I knew it was brand new. Brand new. I could smell the new car smell right away. I don't know if you guys can see the uh, 28 miles there. It's one of my favorite cars. And beside it, we've got a Dodge Challenger. Uh, i got a Dodge Ram pickup. Got another Challenger here. Price of 300. And we got a Toyota RAV4. I'm just gonna walk over here, because I think, yeah, the executive aisle actually extends over here. Oh, looks like we've got, okay, so we've got a couple nice ones here. We've got a Ford Mustang EcoBoost convertible and executive aisle. Like I said, they got so many cars here, I'm gonna have to split this up in a couple videos. And we got a Grand Cherokee, I believe this is the L. This just popped in since uh, since I got here. And, limited. Oh no, it's a Laredo, okay. Let's just take a quick peek in here, I can't. Oh, you know, this might not be an L, it's bigger. But, uh, okay, it's about 10,000 miles on it. Yeah, I don't see seats in the back, so it might not be the L. Uh, what else we got? Okay, we got a Camry over here. Uh, we got Honda, SUV. I don't see those very often in Canada. Got underneath another Nissan uh, Altima Camry. Charger. Oh boy, there are lots of Camrys. And then we got a Mini Cooper here. And got a Camry. And then we got a newer Nissan Rogue. We got another couple. Oh boy, lots of Camrys. Lots of Nissan Altimas an older Nissan Rogue. Uh, I do like these rims they have on the Camrys. And one of those plug-in hybrid Mitsubishis. Oh boy, they must have got a load of Camrys in. Uh, we've got a Chevy Malibu again. This is all executive aisle here. Chrysler 300. And I want to be, uh, oh, I forget the name of those larger Toyota SUVs. It'll come to me. Uh, got another Malibu, different rooms on that one. Uh, again, this is all executive aisle here. We got another pickup truck, a Nissan pickup truck. Ooh, we got another Grand Cherokee. Yeah, this one's definitely yellow. I can see the headrest in the back seat there. Uh, got a RAV4. Okay, that's regular Emerald Isle. Let's keep, oh, you know, executive actually. Oh, boy. Definitely gonna have to put the regular Emerald Isle in another video. So this is still executive here. This is all executive. Very nice blue on this uh, Dodge Challenger. Got a Camry. Got 
a Kia SUV. Somebody's taking a Chevy Blazer. Boy, if you're looking for a Camry or a Malibu, this is definitely the uh, another V6 uh, Challenger coming in. An Audi Q5, maybe? Another Challenger. Ooh, this one's got the sunroof in it. Uh, still the V6. Dodge Ram 1500. And a newer Dodge Ram 1500 with the Hemi in it. Uh, Charger GT. And we got a Maxima here. And again, in the US, they get the SV trim. So it doesn't have the sunroof, it doesn't have the bows, but it's still quite nice. Another uh, Mitsubishi plug-in hybrid. We got a Honda. SUV, Chevy, we got a Ford Explorer, uh, BMW X2, uh, another Camry Sentra. Still got some of these uh, Nissan Muranos here. We've got a VW and a Camry. Ooh, oh, look at this. Okay, so what? what is this, an A6? This looks like it might be. I was going to say an older one. Is this like the one I had out in. Uh, BC. Oh, it's A4. Jeez, it looks bigger. This has got the sunroof. Oh, this would be nice. Let's see, uh, see if there's a newer one, an older one. Yeah, it's got the... I don't think I've seen one with a wooden trim on it. This has... 2,000 miles, maybe? Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, 2,500 miles. It's got the sunroof in it. Oh, that would be nice. Yeah, I haven't seen one of the newer ones yet. Very nice. PW, and we got another pickup truck, and I think that's going to wrap it up. Yeah, the rest over here is the just the regular Emerald Isle, but there's tons of cars in the overflow. Um, so I'm going to wrap up this part of the video. Thanks for tuning in, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.